Hey guys, what's up? I'm going to be doing a very short little book review of the little book of Secret Societies by Joel Levy. Uh, I picked this up at a, uh, it's kind of like Books a Million, it's a uh, fucking, what the fuck is it? <laughs> Silly me. Barnes and Noble. Alright, and it was on discount, and you know, I'm one of these, you know, I'm a hardcore skeptic when it comes to s conspiracy theories. And this is probably the perfect book for skeptics. And conspiracy theorists as well, because it, it does, it does present both sides of the argument. However, it is very tongue-in-cheek, I'll give it that. Uh, it's not that neutral, but it's still a fun read. It is very tongue-in-cheek when it comes to some of these theories, uh, especially the more wild ones, like the whole, you know, the reptilian bullshit or whatever. Uh, I mean, it covers pretty much all of these. I mean, uh, elite societies like Freemasons, Illuminati, Invisible College, Skull and Bones, John Birch, Bohemian Grove, Elk, Bilderberg, etc., Occult Societies, uh, Golden Dawn, Ordo Temple, Orientis, Orvo no Ordo Nove Temple, uh, Druid, Vril Society, Rosicrucians, you know, quite, it runs the gamut, uh, Religious Societies, uh, Mithraism, Knights Templar, Priority of Cyan, etc., uh, Paramilitary and Political ones, now that's my, actually my favorite part of this, despite being more interested in the occult. But, uh, you know, the Assassins, Ku Klux Klan, Black Hand, Al-Qaeda, Criminal Societies, you know, Triad, Yakuza, and Mafia, etc. Yeah, I'm not going to read off all of them, but it pretty much has every one of them in here. And it's really amusing how they describe them. Uh, the... Uh, Title is 50 of the World's Most Notorious Organizations and How to Join Them. Subtitle, excuse me. Uh, how to Join Them. Uh, like the, the Leopard Society. How to Join. Do not don the skin of a leopard and use your steel claws to cut out and eat the heart of a victim. Instead, simply visit ekpe.org. Just, you know, various things. It just has a nice, humorous tone to it but does actually delve into the history and present a lot of logical facts that debunk most of these conspiracies, while at the same time making you wonder about some of the others. So, anyway, my rambling little review is over. If you find it, pick it up. Of course, if you're one of those really paranoid conspiracy theorists, you're going to be like, The Illuminati read it! Ah! Where's my tinfoil hat? <laughs> anyway, peace out.